Okay, so hand-supported Bulgarian split squats. So what you're going to do is get yourself your Bulgarian settle sorted. So whether you're going to be using a single leg squat stand or you use a bench or whatever that is for you, that's absolutely okay. I would recommend using a pad underneath your knee just to make sure that you're hitting depth every single time. And it kind of saves your knees a little bit, especially if you're going heavy. And all you're going to do is get the safety bar on your back as you normally would if you're going to do squats. And you're just going to use the safety bars either side, okay, so these, the squat rack, just to support you, okay, so you're not using this to pull yourself back up, you're just using it for a little bit extra stability, so you can really load up that single leg, that front leg. So as always with your Bulgarians, what I want you to think about is keeping that knee neutral, so you're not going to let it cave inwards, we want to try and keep it in line with your middle toe. One of the other things you can kind of think about to really make sure we're loading up that front leg is kind of reducing the load, reducing the amount of body weight you're putting through that supporting leg at the back. One of the ways I like to do that is just once I've got it set up, I do my squat, but then I'm just going to lift it off slightly. Okay, just a little bit, because then it reminds me that I'm really trying to load up that front leg more. So how it looks, do a squat, a little bit of a lift, like so. 